Besides the birds, it's quiet on Eastland County Road 529. This road leads out to a peninsula on Lake Leon. With the lake just over three feet above capacity, this latest threat of a flood was too much for several neighbors here. They packed up and left for good. I can certainly understand, but at the same time, I hate to see, hate to see people give up. DJ Walker's lived here 16 years. He says he's not moving, but he is preparing. His dock's already underwater, and the lake's been lapping at his backyard. So I've got a trailer in the garage ready to load up and, and uh, get stuff out of here. Right now, the water is going down. You can see how high it got from this debris. DJ says it peaked at about 7 o'clock Wednesday evening. One reason so many people around here are so nervous this time around is because they still remember the flood of 2007 when you could barely see this rooster weather vane on top of this dock. So it was up about this high on the outside. And then, of course, on the inside, it was up cabinet level. In June of 2007, the area around Lake Leon flooded as the lake rose to nearly 11 feet above capacity. We lost everything in our house last time, so we're trying not to deal with the mess. So the Thompsons put their furniture on tables then moved everything they can carry upstairs. They're on the brink. They know just inches of rain could bring another disaster to their own backyards. Is it, is it worth the, the stress? <laughs> to me it is. Yeah. Uh, put up with a little bit of uh, stress for days and days and days of, of enjoyment. Yeah. Along Lake Leon, Will Jensen, KTEX's News.